hear feet. Why can I hear feet? Oh, oh. Uh. Let's. Oh, okay. Are they all turrets? I think they're all turrets, aren't they? Yep. 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 What's that? Um. Do you know what? I'm just gonna. Yep. So somebody's been in here. What's that? Oh, Churchill. God, you scared the life out of me, dog. Right. We've just gotta be. Holy crap on a cracker. Churchill, um, that was either your stomach or s something truly awful. Look at this. Oh, oh, all right. Tickets. Okay. Um, yep. You know, um, this, this does not seem conducive to a good time, does it? What are we here? Tickets. Always take tickets. Yep. Unrusted tin can. I mean, I don't really... Are these... Hmm. Don't seem to be active. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Um, a hairbrush. I don't really need a hairbrush. This is some kind of, I don't know, break room or something? I don't... There's a lot of dead, dead bodies knocking about, which is, yeah... Beds. Is this maybe where test subjects slept? I don't... Oh, okay. Hmm. What's that? <gasps> Cute Thulu. You can feel an ancient power emanating from the doll, something you can't quite put your finger on. I'll take your word for moisturizer. I mean, no thanks. I don't know what somebody's been using that for. It feels a little bit weird. Imagine sleeping in here, though. All these pipes? Good God. Portable ashtray, I'd rather not, thank you. Oh, terminal, okay. All right. Complex? Lighten a zero, hmm, well. Lending, ha ha ha! Um, turret control, can we just turn the turrets off? Uh, please exercise caution around turret. Users should always assume that turrets are loaded and capable of live fire. Um, about your defense system. Turret operation should be limited to trained professionals only. Consumer commands are limited to activation slash deactivation of the turrets hardlined to this terminal. For all other operations, please refer to a licensed technician. Any tampering will void warranty and indemnify the manufacturer against potential injury and or death caused by users or passers-by. Fine. System diagnostics. Eight turrets linked. 
They're all offline. Um. Maybe, maybe we don't turn them on. Maybe that's a good idea. Okay, HR log 01. This month's been adequate for the HR department. We've delivered all subject requests. The scientists haven't once run out of the street urchins or vagrants to experiment with. On the other hand, we've struggled to actually find new scientists. We may have to resort to recruiting the more sane variety. It's a good start. Uh, HR Logo 2. The director managed to snatch up scientists from other labs. They were not pleased about it. This place has a reputation, even in angel circles. Their concerns were, are unfounded. The results here are lax as intended. It's a researcher's dream. In angel circles. Angel circles? Hmm. Okay. Uh, HR Logo 3. We managed to collect a new batch of degenerates. Scavengers, I think. No one will miss them. They even had a child with them. And a ghoul. The DNA engineers will be pleased. Oh my god, what? 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 Uh, HR Logo 4. One of the new scientists is working on a new cloning technique. The director says it has potential. I've moved a security clone to his room. I wouldn't want the brain doctors to get hold of him. Okay. And HR Logo 5. The director has been displeased with me ever since those two subjects escaped. Like most humans, he's blind to reason. The value of the scientists is much greater than that of the subjects. Alright. So is that what A means? Angels? Angels A? Maybe. Maybe. Come on, Churchill. There's, there's, there's more, to see, more to see here. Pull out my pistol. Didn't notice that floor before. Okay, so I think the noise is that way. So we'll we'll avoid that as long as possible. <clears throat> it's just a bathroom. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Soap. Okay. Never mind. Come on, Churchill. I know it's a little, um... Spooky, to say the least. Because it is. It is. I get it. I get it. Aha. Purified water. Tickets. Was that? Um... Hmm... Terminal. Box of Kitchener cigars. I mean, I don't smoke, so probably useless. Expired cigarettes, flip lighter. All useful for junk, I imagine, but our coffers are rather full. So, what's the deal with this thing? A nodding cow. Of all the things. Um, detective case file. Don't know what use that would be, but even you can. Um, well, Churchill, what a um, strange spot. Do you think, puppy? I am curious about the noise. I don't know what it was. I don't know why it was. Should check out down here as well. Before we oh okay. That's a that's a big explosion on the floor. Nothing in this desk. Oh um is there anything over here? Oh what? Oh dear, another dead body. Um, aha. Oh, a little 
bit more. Haha, -ha, we're in. Tickets, um, tickets as well. I mean, this is actually quite a nice, quite a nice room, isn't it? I mean, aside from the the skeleton. Oop. Microscope. Tickets. Another terminal that we can use. Um, nothing in here. Tickets again. Oh, message tubes. High bowler. Undamaged UK flag. Used oil can. Hmm. Well, let's um, take a peep in the terminal, shall we? Uh, regarding concerns. These concerns of yours are entirely unwarranted. Your enthusiasm for efficiency is admirable, but misguided. Truth be told, I have labs filled with nothing but clones, and they do indeed work more efficiently and consistently. They are even more successful most of the time. So why, you ask, do I keep the Monument Lab up and running? Those lunatics, as you call them, have something the clones don't. Creativity. Some incredible things have been discovered in the lab you're sitting in. All of your predecessors had the same concerns. All of them changed their minds. You will soon regret complaining about such trivialities as efficiency. The fact that most of the scientists are mentally unstable is indeed no coincidence. You are correct. The benefit of using clones is that they have no boundaries. They are willing to do the unthinkable. These men also have no such boundaries. P.S. If you're worried about your own safety, don't be. The researcher clones usually stop them from getting too out of hand. S. Who is S? Transfers. If you are indeed losing scientists faster than you can recruit them, I will transfer some over from another lab. This is not a permanent arrangement. Expect them tomorrow at noon. P.S. If I find out, as I suspect, that you have been culling them on purpose in order to subvert my lab's goals, you're finished. S. Huh. Cloning method. Being able to produce clones without vats would indeed be useful. I will await further updates. S. Those bloody... Yeah. Vats of goo. Ugh. Draft. I want a bigger office. Dear esteemed master, I know we haven't been on the best terms lately, but I would like to put in a request for a much larger office space. I live in what can only be described as a glorified broom cupboard. It hardly suits my rank, don't you think? Sincerely, your most faithful director. Interesting. So... I'll take the tape. So... Do you suppose... This is somewhat like a... Like the vaults that were in the US? Or... Like... Okay, screwdriver. Um, lots of dead soldiers. Um... Okay, what's what's in here? Another dead person? Lovely. Maybe I'd better turn that off just in case. If these people in here are indeed lunatics, I would rather um rather not end up dead. Thank you. Oh, good lord. Coffee tin, aluminium can, teapot. Detective case file. Are these important? Possibly. Tickets. Another terminal. Okay, experiment 13A. The first experiment on Project Theseus was a resounding failure. The subject died almost immediately. After successfully removing the left arm and soldering the prosthetic one, subject entered cardiac arrest. I told Barry we needed more lidocaine. The fact we have to keep them awake makes this so much more difficult. Experiment 13b. The second experiment somehow went even worse. We had barely removed the subject's left arm when it happened. We can't even work out why they passed. They must have literally died of shock. Fudging pussy. Experiment 13c. Okay, things are looking up for Barry and me. We managed to do all the limbs and even a couple of organs. Subject died after a dodgy incision in the left ventricle. 
To be fair, that was probably on us. There is no way the subject could have survived that. Experiment 13D. Fudging Kaching. We finally have the answer to the age-old question. When is a human no longer a human? When you systematically replace every part of their body, that's when. The brain was tricky because you can't just replace the whole thing. That would be pointless. We had to do it bit by bit. I hope the director is happy with these results. Experiment 13E. Turns out the director wanted one final experiment. He asked if I could do it alone, and I said yes. First of all, for the record, Barry was a fudging champ about it. I could tell he was really trying to stay alive for me. Annoyingly, he passed away during the brain stage, which is very unfortunate. The director was furious. Hopefully I won't become... Hopefully I won't be some other scientist lab rat in a few days. So... Take it this is Barry. Maybe? Um, oh. Churchill, I... I feel quite... Um, oh! Quite... Um, perturbed by this whole thing because, um, okay, it was being filmed, there's a, that's a human arm? Looks like he has a claw, ooh, coal claw, oh, okay, mangy fox, so, what's that? That's a cat, oh no! Oh dear. House cat. I mean, dearie me. So, do you know, Churchill? I I think we should we should leave this laboratory right now because that is quite. Quite ghastly. Is there anything else in here? Okay. Anything in the desks? No. Alright. Ah. This looks to be a similar room as to what we were in. A 9 volt battery. Tickets. Hmm. Yep. Another terminal. Requires a key. Oh, so there's going to be a key somewhere? Desk fan. Okay. What's that? Just a bowl. Bowl in a bed. This, um... Seems... Very off. Does it not, Churchill? Let's put a little, little light here. I fear that um, whatever happened here, we may or may not find out. We'll have a look at that terminal in a moment. Just have a little nosy round. Good God. And see if we can find that key. If not, it's potentially somewhere else within within the building. A fuse ticket. Old flip light is probably useful. Well. Has some value to it. Um tickets. Yeah. Expired cigarettes, tickets, tickets. Iron brew, bowler hat, tickets again, chocolate bar, beer bottle, well, but no key. Well, maybe this terminal will assist us in getting a key. Hello? Oh. Doesn't appear to be working. That's kind of a shame. Hmm. 
So where might one find the key for this terminal, I wonder? Over here. Is it on the desk? Hmm. Magnifying glass. Well. What is that? It's a hat. Oh no, I've just realised that what that means. Oh dear. I'm guessing then that, um... Yes, maybe, maybe... Whoever was in there is, um, yes, not in a good way. All right, Churchill. Well, I suppose we'd better go and investigate this noise, had we not. Much as I am... Um, somewhat averse to it, it's probably going to hold the key to what we need. Is there any keys here? No. Okay. Sensor module. Mm -mm. Okay. Well, well. Let's, um. This is a brilliant sign, is it not? Lots of dead folks. Uh, requires a terminal. Hmm. I'm guessing it's that terminal that needs a key. Is the key on any of these folks? Chill, chill, chill. Come on. Is it the terminal in that other room? That we've just been in? Just as a thought. I think it'll be that one. Will it be this one? Yes, it will. What a guess. Turn on the power. What? Well, where's the pa Okay. Why do I have a feeling that when I turn on the power, all of these are going to come alive and... Um, Kill me. Power. Power, pa power, 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 power. Be in that other room, I think, won't it? With the, um... The big crackling transformer, I imagine. Yep. Um Okay. Run. All right. All right. Um Yep. I bloody predicted it. <sighs> well, God bless it all. one. Hmm. Okay. You know what? We could probably... Wasn't the other terminal put in here? controlled the turrets. Could we turn them off? No, this is the bloody bathroom. God bless it. Shh, Churchill. It was in here. Ah, ha, ha. Okay. Um, turret control. Deactivate. Ah. <sighs> Well, that should hopefully make life a little bit easier, should it not? 
We won't die a horrible death to some bloody turrets. So we'll take those. And those. Okay. Okay. Was it down here? Yes, it was. Right at the end. Okay. Here we go. Um. Hmm. Well, why? Why did they have to send me here? Everyone knows this is where Smythe sends all the crackpots and lunatics. The other scientists are an absolute nightmare to deal with. I need to get out of here. I need to prove myself. I need to do something big. Co-workers. My co-workers are fudging sadistic. They insist on using human subjects, and when human resources can't snatch people off the streets fast enough, they experiment on each other. Fudge, they'll probably experiment on me soon. Okay. Sludge. Eureka. Flash cloning will soon be a thing of the past. My new method is faster, more efficient, and you won't even need vats. Just chuck some sludge on the ground and you'll grow a fully-fledged super soldier in seconds. Though you'll probably want to give them clothes first. Hmm. Are we sludge? Did we come from... No, we were in a vat, weren't we? Are we a clone? I think we're a clone. Director. The director is very interested in my experiments. I brought myself a couple of months at the very least. I actually have security protecting me now. Hmm. Shiz. I may have been overconfident in my abilities. I haven't once been able to recreate the moderate success of that initial experiment. I thought I'd have a working solution by now. That's what I told the director at least. I'm so fudged. I need to do something drastic. I'll increase the potency of the sludge compound. Oh god. The sludge came to life, didn't it? The sludge has come to life. Why am I doing this? Why am I unlocking this 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 room that probably holds death? Because I'm a fool, that's why. Okay, Churchill. I think we just we just need to be we just need to be a little a little careful here because I have a horrible feeling. Would the key be in there? We can look for the key after. Enough of my nonsense. Okay. Um. Hello? Hello? Oh god, oh god, can I, can I leave? What? No! What the hell is that? Super clone experiment? Are you crazy? I, 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 I feel a little... What the hell is that? Can we, can we... Um... Oh god, um... Maybe, maybe I should eat something. Um... You know? Just to kind of... Get myself reasonably healthy. Oh my God, what the hell is that? What is that? Why does it have all these little points on its body? Why is its face like that? What is going on? Um. Okay. Um. Hi. There. Did, what? What? What am I actually? Um. Yeah. Fight it. Fight it. Oh yeah. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Me and what army? Okay. 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 I might have to just just run. Just run. Just run. Just run. Just run. Oh, crumbs. This is not good. Where is it? Where is it? Oh my god, 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 oh
god, oh my 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 god, why, 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 why? Okay. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, it's, I can feel it, I can feel it on my back. Okay, I missed, I bloody missed, oh god. Um, can I? Can I? Oh Jesus, run! Oh my god! I don't like it. I don't like it. It's stinky. Okay. Okay. Just, 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 just. All right. Okay. It's, 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 it's big, but it's big, but, but, but. Can I? Oh God, really? Oh God, really? Oh God! I thought I was holding grenades or something. Okay, it's 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 big, but it's kind of okay. It's not that slow. It's not that slow. Oh jeez. Oh god. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Let's just 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 just. just. God, I, have I got any grenades or something? Something we can just launch at it. Um. Build or frag mines. I just uh. Mm. Plasma ordnance. I don't really know what that does. Rad grenades. I could chuck a rad grenade at it. That might, 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 might do something. Would that make it? That might make it mutate though. Um. Okay. Do you know what? Do you know what? That's fine. Just, 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 just. Oh god. Oh. Oh no. is a super clone what is a super clone i mean that's a super clone but i killed it i killed it look at that face though ah ugly gross okay sentinel's pipe wrench take 15 percent less damage while standing and not moving okay uh tickets Shock electric prod. I would rather not. Thank you. Oh my god, we did it! What's this? Money. Hey. Safe. So. Oh god. There we go. Yep, yep, yep. So why, what, why, how, when, where, who came up with it, why did they come up with it, what was its purpose? Oh, jeez. Cigarettes. I don't really want cigarettes. Is there anything else in here? Anything useful to me? Oh, I'm glad Churchill wasn't in here to... To, to tango with that because yeah Geiger counter bobby pin tickets rounds radex braced painted metal arm what's the in terms of our what we're actually wearing at the moment Uh, metal left leg leaded shadowed left leg hmm well let's pop that on service rifle I've already got one of those um, commando knife did you okay Okay, a load of garbled rubbish. <clears throat> something, something, something. It's proving to be a verifiable asset, maybe? Something. False mem memories. 
training false memories significantly in the field further refinement of the techno automatic corruption on 19th of the 4th of 37 okay what about this one um undergoing diagnostic tests which may require replacement pay software bug in the objects programming is required and to identify the root cause hmm. automatic corrupted same date log lab shutdown the date is the 19th of the 4th 37 the director is dead I am now in command this is my final report the rest of this log is for Smythe's eyes only ensure it is delivered to her current laboratory of residence an experiment involving a new cloning technique has failed critically, resulting in a lab shutdown. The state of the lab was unrecoverable at the time I took command. The scientist behind this disaster was the first to be killed by his own creation. Disciplinary action was therefore not possible. They have four test subjects that I have moved into the contamination room. They believe this is for their own safety. The vagrants will act as bait to lure the abomination into the room. Once inside, I will subsequently lock the doors, remotely shut down the main power supply, and terminate myself. I hope this course of action is satisfactory, given the circumstances. Be seeing you. Log automatically forwarded to Station Laboratory in... Mm. Mm. But still no keys. Very, um... Very irritating, is it not, Churchill? But at least we um, took care of the problem. Good lord. Oof. Absolutely grotesque. Hmm. Well, sensor module. Any keys here? The key might be in that office, actually. In the little office. In here. Do you have any keys, sir? No. Well, that's mildly irritating. We could have potentially found out some more information, I fear, but... Maybe not. Take one last peep, just to be sure. Requires a key. Hmm. I don't suppose anybody would just leave the key lying around, would they? Doesn't look like it, unfortunately. Hmm. Cigarettes. Ugh. Morse telegraph. Hmm. Pneumatic cylinders. More pneumatic cylinders. Think what? Large beaker. Not planning on doing any science myself. Um. Wow, it got dark. This is weird. It's a weird place. I can't help but wonder if we have found that key. I don't think that it was around here anywhere. Let's just take a quick look. Policeman's truncheon. Okay. Hmm. Pigeons. Okay. Just, um... Whether we could have found out some more information for Archie, but I just couldn't see it in there. Coffee cup. What I don't understand. What I don't quite understand, Churchill, is. What, um, what the monster was for? What's up 
this way. Is this something we can access? Do you suppose? We could. Let's... another way in I think another way in come on Churchill let's go we can um, yes we can possibly go back and find out with that key I just don't wish to get caught out here if we can avoid it because quite frankly that monster was enough supposed to have come this way Churchill this looks very um very occupied yes there you go who are they who are you settlers would settlers have an issue with us you suppose probably not the settlers maybe they'll trade I do have some things uh hello London Bridge. Hello? Hello? Are you... Hello? Um... Roll up, roll up, oh. ladies, gents, schools, tamesfolk, and all identities. That's... Step right up and pay the toll tax for the safety of the finest bridge in all of London. Don't be shy, it's only ten tickets per person. And I promise, the view is worth every penny. I... Now, I know what you're thinking. Why should I pay oh. a toll tax when I can just swim across the river? Well, let me tell you, my friend. You can't. The river is infested with all sorts of nasties. Rads, mitten lurks, you name it. Wanna cross Tower Bridge? Chisha, what That's are you doing? Worst of all, cannibals. Yes, you heard me right. Cannibals. Why are you dressed as well? No, I'm not saying that you're going to get eaten alive if you don't pay the toll tax. But let's just say that if you don't, you might end up on the menu yourself. And trust me, you don't want that. Not when you could be enjoying a nice juicy Brahmin steak instead. But don't take my word for it. Just look at this bridge. I... It's secure, safe, a work of art, isn't it? Built to last. Um... With the finest materials and the sturdiest construction. London Bridge ain't falling down this in this Is this actually ribeye steak? Built. Who do you think pays for all that? That's right. You do. So why not do your civic duty and contribute to the maintenance and upkeep of this fine piece of engineering? Safe crossing, rebuilding London. It's a win-win situation if you ask me. One price. Ten tickets. Hmm. Um. Is this... Are you... Hello? Okay. Beefy. All right. So, how about it? Care to make the passage? Why do you have blood dripping from your mouth? Um Did did you just say something about cannibals? Ah, so you've heard of them, have you? Yeah, they ain't the nicest of chaps, them. You dressed like one, why? Um What's with the costume? What do you mean? It's just clothes. Now, I'm collecting tolls for the bridge. Ten ticks, please. Yeah, Riff Raff, what are you talking about? Oh, you know, the usual suspects. Cannibals, psychopaths, hooligans, ferals. 
The type of people who would eat their own grandmother if they were hungry enough. Yeah, so, um... What kind of con are you running here? Nothing too complicated, my friend. Just a simple tour scam. I collect the tickets and the boss takes his cut. Easy as pie. It's actually honest. We do keep it safe, you know. Takes his cut of what? To put in pie, I imagine, as you mentioned. I'm guessing you're working with the other cannibal beef eaters. Just guessing. All right, all right, keep your voice down. Yes, I used to be one of them. But I saw the error of my ways and decided to turn over a new leaf. Promise. Now I'm just a simple con man. Trying to make an honest living. <laughs> Full disclosure. It was a dark time in my life, mate. I was young and hungry. I didn't care where my next meal came from. But then I got abandoned on a fucked mission and met a group of regulars. You know, the boring type who didn't eat people. Anywho, they took the time to show me the error of my ways. So I left the beef eaters and started my new life as a con man. Not strictly honest work. But a damn sight more honest than chomping on my mates. And I've never looked back. Sure, I use my past as a way to keep the beefies off this bridge as a form of racket. But it all works out in the end. The traders and settlers don't get eaten, and I make some ticks on the side. My issue is that my old boss is still after more meat. I've been trying to fend him off with more ticks. And it's been working. But I know how bad that craving gets. With his own roots dried up, I bet you soon his belly will be rumbling more than his care for Wonga. Hmm. I'll tell you what. You get rid of the sick bastard breathing his meaty breath down my neck. As well as his cabal of cunts. And I'll dismiss my mates here and give you this bridge to work with. Only caveat is that you keep me on as a guard. Yeah? Then, we've both scratched each other's backs. All I ask is if you do it, you bring me back proof. I know what he's like, mate. Cannibals don't tend to eat their own. But imagine if you fuck this up. I'll be on a meat hook in no time. Um... Well... I do have some other things that I want to take care of first, you know? Of course, of course. Take your time, my friend. But don't take too long. Or I might have to find someone else to do the job. You, you, you're a creepy, creepy dude, man. I don't like you at all. You're up to something. It's suspicious. Sus as all hell. London Settlement Workbench. Oh. Could I scrap things here? No. Oh, I've got to be allied to the settlement. Well, this seems off to me. I don't like it one drop. Churchill, where are you? Let's let's um, um, let's go. I don't like this dude. He's weird. A weirdo. What a weirdo! Oh my God. I don't think he's left those cannibals at all. I think he's still working with them. And you know what? It all bloody stinks, lad. The whole kitten caboodle. Yeah, summit's definitely off. Definitely off. Well, Archie, um, bad news, mate. You're back. Did you find them? I didn't find them. No. I say, thanks for trying and for letting me know. Do All you right. know what happened? Um, I'm not sure what happened. The lab was a mess. Oh, maybe that's for the best. Thank you. Okay. 
Not sure what to do now. I can't stay here forever. I know that. Oh, yeah. The girl. Yes. He went west, I think. West? He said he was going to St. Paul's Sanctuary. Oh. Hmm. That's where I was going to take you. Unless you want to save me the journey, Wayfarer. Since you're headed that way. I ain't much in a fight, but I'm good with locks. Terminals too. Um. Well, tell me about St. Paul's Sanctuary. Used to be St. Paul's Cathedral. Been around for youngs. Oh. They offer sanctuary to all those who need it. The trouble is getting there. Hmm. Um. Do you think Lazarus made it? It's possible. He ran faster than I did. Hmm. I mean, I'll take you to St. Paul's, but that's it. That's fine with me. Let's get out of here. Farewell, Churchill? Boy. No! Don't let this city change you. Wayfarer, if you're ever in Thameshaven again... No! Pay me a visit. We have some important work for you. Good. I don't want Churchill to leave. You, you, you go with the ferryman or you follow with us. It doesn't matter. Okay, let's go then, I suppose. So, is it up here, I assume? Oh, we've still got to find that girl, haven't we, as well? Hmm. You don't know anything about a girl, do you, Archie? No, you know about as much as Churchill does by the looks of it. Okay, let's go.